a meaningful occasion. And all week long, the football chatter has centred around this game and these talented teams. Which one will outwit the other in a packed and passionate stadium? So many questions to be answered on a day of destiny. Stay tuned for all the action. And now they get the ball rolling. And here's the starting 11 for Barcelona. Mark andre Ter Stegen in goal. Ilkay Gundogan plays alongside Frenkie de Jong in the centre of midfield. And getting the vote of confidence in attack today, Robert Lewandowski. And a look at... And it's a really poor challenge. Now, what's the referee going to do about it? So we have an early booking here to report, Stuart. Yeah, I think the referee's absolutely right. He's just making it clear to all the players out there, he's not going to take any messing about here. And a super header. It looked as though it might be going in. Corner for Barcelona. Played over. Danger still on. Gundogan. But he tried in vain to get himself back on side. Well, he needs to show greater awareness there and hold on to the ball a fraction longer. Well, good effect of pressure. Chilwell. Well, if you're looking for somebody to change the course of a game, look no further than Rafinha. What might we see from him today? Well, Derek, I thought he was brilliant last time out. Scored a couple of goals, but it's his general play as well that was excellent. Coming short to receive the ball, making runs in behind defenders. He was outstanding, and I'm sure we're going to see more of the same today. Well, it wouldn't stay in play for them. Goal kick. Rafinha. I'm hearing someone has scored in the Borussia Dortmund game, but exactly who? Alex Scott will tell us. Yes, it's a goal for Borussia Dortmund. They're the first on the score sheet here with 11 minutes on the clock. Many thanks, Alex. James. Ronald Araujo, Pedri, Joao Felix, can he find the net? Oh, he's blocked it! James, and plenty of space for this Chelsea attack, and a useful cross, clears it away. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Nkunku. Can he give them the advantage? He's blocked it. Well, news to bring you from one of the other games, and big news at that. Here's Alex Scott. Yeah, Leverkusen were awarded the penalty. He hit it straight down the middle. Keeper didn't even move. It's now one all with 24 minutes played. Thanks as always to Alex Scott. The cross is on. 
to Stegen. It's an unbelievable save. Who can he pick out? Well, not the best clearance. Oh, fantastic effort. He made great contact, but the keeper more than equal to it. Well, opting for the short corner. Just the challenge that was required. And that move comes to an end. Goal kick. An encouraging move from Barca, but nothing comes of it. Jackson. And well, the defenders know they need to get tighter. He's got to score! A smart stop here. Save, but still a chance. Well, threat averted. Rafinha. Gundogan Lewandowski Rafinha Return to Lewandowski And a goal! That will do it! They've been pushing for it And now they've been rewarded Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. Just watch his technique here. He just hits through the back of the ball with such power. There's no stopping that. Well, he has to get his team playing again. This isn't going to plan. So the match has restarted. 1-0 here. He's in control of the situation. Perfect challenge. Joao Felix. This is Robert Lewandowski. Gundogan. It's got to be! They've only gone and grabbed another one. Two goals in quick succession. Now they have the lead. No wonder they're celebrating. Well, just look at this pass from Gundogan and his movement so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one thought in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal. Well, back to the drawing board, I'm afraid. His team have been really poor today. So back underway with the lead standing at 2-0. Well, the referee has instructed the fourth official to put two minutes on the board. Now winning back possession. So the whistle then. We're up the halfway stage in this match. Well, Christopher Nkunku is frequently such a focal point but not really having his say so far, is he? Yeah, he's not played well, has he? He's just failed to have an impact here. Mind you, I think we could say that about the whole team. He just hasn't looked like scoring today. Into the second half then, and it's not lost on Chelsea that they need to raise their game here. And a scoring update for you from the Borussia Dortmund match. Alex Scott has the information. It's a goal for Valencia. The score... Oh, hang on, Alex. Big chance here. 
Gundogan. Oh, surely. And the post getting in the way. Well, sincere apologies to Alex, I must say, because we had to cut her off just when she was in full flow. And he scored not once, but twice. They simply cannot stop him. And no wonder he's enjoying himself. Well, here it is again. And it's a superbly weighted through ball to break that defensive line. And it makes the striker's job so easy. All he has to do is make the right connection. It's a lovely goal. This is going to be a thrashing. 3-0 now. Chaloba. Nkunku. And fed forwards. Sterling. Sterling. And the keeper to the rescue. Well, he takes some beating, that's for sure. It really is a top-class save. And over comes the corner. Clearance left a bit to be desired. And Sterling has it. Takes the shot. And the keeper more than equal to it. Now well, something has changed at the Red Bull Arena. That means we get the information from Alex Scott. And it's a two now with 53 minutes played Alex thank you very much well, let's see about the cross and well, they can't quite take advantage in the end Lewandowski Lewandowski it's with Joao Cancelo Joao Felix a goal how about to make it a hat-trick. Well, here's the replay. He does well to find that bit of space in the box, and then he shows a lot of composure to finish it off. That's a good goal. Well, that's not a happy manager. He knows he's got a lot of work to do now. A lopsided contest, 4-0. Thiago Silva. Chilwell. Moises Caicedo. And return to Chilwell. Caicedo, Sterling, and flag raised, offside. Well, that was always going to be offside. He just needed to hold on to the ball that little bit longer. <laughs> 20 minutes to go in this one. James Moises Caicedo Nkunku has it just not looking confident in possession making use of his physical strength to hang on to it Lewandowski and opting for power over placement but not the desired result
Lewandowski. Plenty of support here, but timely defending when it mattered. Nkunku. Just ten minutes remaining here. Lewandowski. Firing it in. And a goal to delight the fans. Just what they were hoping for. Well, here you can see what a good goal this is. He hits it so cleanly and the keeper has no chance. That's a great strike. Well, he knows his team haven't been good enough in this game, but how does he change it? Well, if there were any lingering doubts about the outcome, surely they now have been removed. Jackson on the ball. Nkunku has it. But a goal to let you know about in the City game. Alex Scott has the information for us. It's a goal from Manchester City. They're now behind by one with 85 minutes played. Alex with the info as ever. It's still alive. He succeeded in getting his fist to it. Well, not a great cross, making the goalkeeper's job rather easy. Rafinha. Pedri. And we are going to have two additional minutes. Pedri. What a genuine opportunity, but it was squandered. Goal kick. And they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. And the final whistle has sounded, the end of the game here, a win for Barcelona. No fans are going to be happy about that. Well, Derek, what a good performance that was. They did most things right, and their attacking play was inventive and had a real cutting edge. That was a really dominant display from them today.